In this video, we're going to look at answering a question on the legislative process. There's a lot of information to memorise here, but SAC and exam questions on the legislative process are pretty straightforward. That means you probably won't get an exam question asking you to outline the whole legislative process. You could, however, be asked a question on any of the stages in the process, so you need to have a sound knowledge of every stage. The process begins with the introduction and the first reading. At this stage, a minister will notify Parliament that he or she wants to present the bill. The minister reads the title of the bill and distributes copies to the other MPs. Next, there's the second reading. Here, the minister responsible for the bill gives a speech to Parliament outlining the bill's purpose. The MPs have a pretty extensive debate and then vote for or against the bill's continuation. If a particularly controversial bill passes the second reading stage, the Speaker of the House will step down and the House will examine the bill in a lot of detail, making amendments to it as they go along. In the lower house, this is known as the consideration in detail stage. In the upper house, it's the committee of the whole stage. Next, the third reading occurs. In this stage, the house votes to formally accept or reject the bill. Then the bill goes to the upper house and the whole process is repeated. However, if the upper house amends the bill in any way, it has to go back to the lower house for approval. If the bill passes through both houses, it then goes to the crown for royal assent. Royal assent is when the Crown formally approves the bill, which means that it can become law. Finally, the bill is proclaimed in the Government Gazette. The proclamation will usually state the day that the Act will come into effect. If it does not, the Act will officially become law 28 days after Royal assent is given. And that's the process. There's the introduction in the first reading, second reading, consideration in detail or committee of the whole, third reading, upper house, Royal assent and proclamation. Do memorise everything we've just gone through because the exam might specifically ask you about one or more of the stages. Thanks for watching and happy studying.